Hi, I'm Carol with the Roaming Boomers. Right now, I'm sitting in our guest room at the beautiful Fairmont Banff Springs Hotel. It's in Banff, Alberta, Canada. We've continued on our trip through the Canadian Rockies. This place is an 1888 majestic Scottish castle surrounded by mountains, forests, and lakes. It's got some of the most stunning views I've ever seen. You know, we haven't stayed at every hotel in the world, but I can't imagine that there's many who could match the grandeur and majesty of this place. This year, Condé Nast named it as one of the best places in the world to stay. I got to agree with them. You need to put this place on your list and come see it for yourself. The Fairmont Bam Springs Hotel is an internationally recognized symbol of Canadian hospitality. Construction began in the spring of 1888, and by the 1930s, the hotel had gained the reputation as one of the most luxurious hotels in North America, and was then dubbed the Castle in the Rockies. With its grand foyers and elegant surroundings, the castle welcomes guests from all over the world with a warmth and intimacy that flows through every room. In 1995, the hotel added a $12 million state-of-the-art spa, complete with three pulsating waterfalls surrounding a mineral pool located right in the heart of the spa. This quiet sanctuary is the perfect place to spend an afternoon and let all your cares be washed away. Just being there is a joy. The variety of dining experiences available at the hotel is as vast as the mountains surrounding the resort. We chose to dine in the intimate setting of Grape's Wine Bar. This quaint, cozy room was originally a writing room. The room has now been transformed into a romantic Canadian bistro, where you'll enjoy award-winning wines paired with the exquisite flavors of their locally sourced menu. Once again, it's time for us to pack up and head out. Don't forget to visit our website, theromingboomers.com. You can also find us on Facebook and Twitter. Make sure that you join our Travel Rewards Club. I'm Carol. This is goodbye until the boomers roam again.